B-R-W-C-E, reigniting backyard wrestling. And don't you wish you were me, the king of all you see? And don't you wish you were me, it ain't that easy? And don't think you'll ever be, everything a man should be? Cause don't you wish you were me, keep dreaming, you'll never be me. Hello, ladies and gentlemen, Sean Jovi here with another exciting vlog bit, and uh, I'm running out of them as you've noticed. So uh, today, I decided to buy some Pokemon Oreos and try and get a $5,000 Mew cookie that uh, definitely aren't worth $5,000. So we're going to open the box, and we're going to sift through each and every one of these until I find a Mew cookie. Uh, let's see, is it Mew? It's Squirtle! Uh, seeing true. Uh, Dratini. Dratini's cool. And then we got, and then we got a Grookey, the little monkey thing. And, and, and Pikachu! That's gotta be super rare, right? super de duper rare. Charmander. Charmander! Uh... Roll it. There's gotta be a Mew in here. That's all I care about. I don't even. Yeah, I only care about the eating the cookies that aren't Mew. Julia? You son of a bitch, shut the fuck up. I will mute your ass. All right. I want a Mew. Mew? 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 I'm just searching for Mews. I, I'll eat these cookies later. Cookies aren't what's important, the Mew is what's important. Because I want to show everyone I am unmusputed king of cookies. That was the terrible way of saying undisputed. Nope. Nope. Hey, Piplup, here you go, camera guy. I don't want you to Piplup. I want to eat all these cookies. If I will donate half these cookies to Sudzo if I get a Mew. And we're running slim. Oh no! Oh, I probably shouldn't do that. I want to keep my cookies up. PSA 10. Because apparently that's the thing for Pokemon marks. Uh, Pancham. Dratini. Snivy. I think my dreams are a dud. Dratini. How is Dratini common? Dratini's like the best. And then we got a Pikachu. A Sableye. Alright, nothing. We don't got a damn Mew. I am not $5,000 richer at a PSA 10. I'm at a PSA 0. And now that it's a PSA, I might as well just call it a PMS. I have something to say. I have something to say about WCE. What happened to Dash Andrews at Fight or Fright? I don't know. I, I can't make up an excuse. I, I let my condition take the best of me. When Dash Andrews didn't go out there and Hollow did, it kind of didn't feel right. Letting Johnny face that thing. Now, Johnny, I hope we can have our one-on-one -on -one match, you know, man the man, instead of one of my, my special demons in my head, like, take my spot. But, you know, I think I can only blame myself for everything. Ever since I lost to Adonis Filios in my debut match, I just haven't been really the same. And you know, I really need to let this out. I don't think I've really felt like me since I came to WCE. So I'm gonna say this. 
whoever wants to face me in a match at the next WC event, I'm all for it. But it ain't going to be just any kind of match. It's going to be a hardcore match. Because I might be Dash Andrews, and I might have a condition, but I need to do what I came to WCE for. And that is to become not only the world champion, but to prove to everyone of why Dash Andrews is the future. And I also want to prove to everyone of why I'm here to fight. Because I am an extreme wrestler and I want my matches to be nothing but extreme. I want to I want to see somebody cracked over the skull with a chair. I want to I'm sorry. Let me calm down real quick. I just I just love weapons. All right. So WCE at the next WC event hardcore match Whoever wants to face me, I'm open to anybody. I just want to show you the real Dash Andrews. While the season's over, I ended on a high note. I won a match. I've also refocused my priorities. Because next season, April 30th, <clears throat> Craven, when I talked to you, I said, I'm not afraid at all of you. You see, fear is an interesting thing. Those who actually know fear and have known their fears coming true, they don't really get scared that easily. Now, you like to use fear as a mind game advantage chess play. Well, bad idea with me, buddy. You see, I'm going to take that attempt at trying to scare me and I'm going to find everything I can do. Bring out your worst fears. You see, you're looking at somebody who, on the surface, doesn't look that harmful. Yeah, I'm a pretty chill guy. If you're on my good side. Now, you haven't really gotten on my bad side, but... Yeah, knowing you, you'll probably try. And that's... The real thing. See, you, Mr. Craven, you're the one who's afraid. You use all your mind games to play with people. You talking to John Jovi. I had to help him find that spark in him that he thought he lost. Now, I have time. I have plenty of time. You see, in that match with Jovi, I kind of sprained my calf muscle, my right leg. Why am I saying that? Because it's just a sprain, so I don't have to worry about the time when we get in the ring together. You see, unlike you, I know how to make people afraid of me. Unlike you, it doesn't require some silly mind games. Unlike you, I know hell. I've seen hell. I've felt hell. Until you lose things that you care about the most, until you see horrifying things like I have, you'll know nothing of fear. So tell me, Craven, do you really want to play that game with me? Because I can tell you this much. It's a game you cannot win, and I will hurt you. 
I will humble you and I will make you afraid. Because in the end, Craven, all I'm doing is what I'm meant to do. And this psycho wolf is on the hunt. And my first, first victim of the new season will be you. From Mongo Management Incorporated and Darkfire. Happy, Happy Thanksgiving, Thanksgiving, you fucks. You fucks. Love you, WC. Sean Jovi, host of the vlog, obviously. Um, it's been a very messy couple weeks. I haven't had a lot of chances to vlog or not a lot's been going on around here, so I haven't really been doing much. Um, but I hope you all had a great Thanksgiving. I personally had a good one. I have spent it with my family. And then, you know, it was nice. And I, there's a lot for me to be thankful for this year. I mean... WC coming into my life, Mike, Billy, all of them, Johnny, James, for everyone, you know, Cole coming back, like Belial, it's Bobby, you know, all my friends are all in this together, and unfortunately it's the off season now, and, you know, I'm thankful to get some rest, but I'm going to be at a, I'm going to be kind of rusty come spring. But all in all, I hope you all had a great Thanksgiving. Like I said, I might not be posting a lot of vlogs too often. I don't know what's going to happen over the next few months. With it being winter and not much going on in general. But I appreciate you all for watching. Be sure to subscribe and all that other fun stuff. And we'll catch you down the road. Bye!